I really wish I could play on uh, higher settings with uh, without my computer I'm reading. Oh wait, wait, there is a way I can do that. Yeah, stay tuned to find out. What is up, guys and girls and all? Adam Sweet here today playing some Ark Survival Evolved on the Ark Survival Evolved Lost Island BC Gaming Community Modern Server. And guys, today I'm going to show you guys how to max out your FPS so you can run on higher settings without overheating your computer and it's going to help you make better, better, uh, nicer looking video. And by the way, guys, if you like this video, make sure you squish that like button. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Go and subscribe if you haven't already and slap the notification bell for future videos coming out just like this one. All right, now let's get started. Um, now, we, um, I'm not gonna, I'll talk about it a little bit afterwards, but right now I'm going to show you how to do it because those of you here to see how to actually do it. Um, I'm going to hit tab, uh, T, period, it does not have to be capitalized, max FPS. I'm going to do 30. I'll tell you why here in just a second. Hit enter. You see the marker? It should be dropping down. And there it is at 30. And now, what's going to happen is, it's going to make this a lot, a lot easier on my computer. I can run higher settings now. Um, I'm maxing out my 30 FPS. Uh, now, when I'm playing, I'm, I'm playing, I do 60. But when I'm recording, I do 30. Because there's a reason for that. With YouTube, um, um, they process uh, only 30 frames per second. So I have to record at 30 frames per second to not get any weird um, buffering stuff happening. You know, cloudiness, which might have been the first few seconds of this video. Um, so what you have to do is, it's better to play at 30 frames per second. It makes the, the rendering and the upload and the processing on YouTube's end so much better. Same thing with streaming. I highly recommend running your game at 30 frames per second when you're streaming. YouTube and Twitch both, they process their stuff at 30 frames per second, and you can't get any more than that. And if you do any more, it's going to be a blurry-ass screen. So if you ever did a video that's like 4K quality, you run at 60 frames per second, 90, and it looks so good, and then you render it, and it looks fine, and you upload it, and it is blurry as hell, that's because you recorded and you had your game at too high a frame per second, and the uh, frequency wasn't able to balance it out. I know it sounds like a random garbage I'm talking about here, but it's it's stuff I figured out along the way. Also, it's great. This way you can run 60 FPS on Arc with a mid-tier, lower tier computer. You can actually run a lower tier computer on a high lower tier computer on higher settings when you can cap your frames out to say 30, 40, or 50, and it'll run just fine. And it's I mean right now there's no Arc max setting. We have to do this to max it out for tab. So what happens is your stuff is gonna fluctuate. It's going to over, overwork your uh, GPU. It's constantly trying to get those better frames, 120, 130, you know, that's what mine usually does when I'm not, when I don't have uh, Streamlabs open because I'm literally, when you have a uh, recording software open, you're literally running two games at once. You, your computer is seeing two games twice and processing both of those. So when you're recording, you definitely want that down to 30 frames per second, whether or not YouTube's going to mess up or not. So, um, um, it's better, better life for you, Peter. Um, uh, guys, that's pretty much it for today. I hope, I hope it helps you out. Remember, uh, it is T period max FPS space, whatever frame you want to set it as. Um, yeah, guys, if you like this video, make sure you squish that like button. Let me know if you comes below. Check the Discord below. Check out the community. This server is available to anyone in the community. It's a modern server. So, uh, it's a fun PvE server. So, let me know if you want to join. Just join Discord and check out the information there. And, uh, guys, y'all, y'all have an awesome day.